man. Last week was insane. <laughs> Yo, I think I lost a little bit of money in certain places, man. Everything was an upset. Everything. Everybody that was a favorite, damn near lost, man. I had the little bet going, saying I was going to wear the Detroit hat, the Lions hat. I was going to get the order in. I might have the hat already, by the way. You never know. <laughs> Probably in the closet, sitting in the, the case. And, you know, you pop it open. The gold shines on it. Um, I'm, We're going to keep it in the closet for now. Because I feel like I didn't win. Y'all didn't win. Because all the picks I've seen in the comment section, they're both as bad. It was bad. It, it was terrible. This is week three redemption. All right. So let's 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 try to figure this out. You ready? We're gonna get into it. Um, the first wait wait we gotta do the deck. We gotta do the deck. Got to. Yes! Here we go. <laughs> it's crazy. He's gonna get popular of just that dude having one nothing, but that shit's gonna make a. All right, we're not gonna talk about Dallas. We can't make this about Dallas. Um, first game we got here Thursday night, which is tonight. Listen, these are professional picks. All these, all y'all want to call y'all bookies. Listen to your boy. So we got the Jets beating the Patriots, man. That's that's easy work. That's light work, man. Light work, light work. Aaron Rodgers getting the groove. He back slinging that ball. Going crazy. So, New York. Jets. Beating the Patriots, all right? Ooh, the Giants are so pathetic. I try to choose them to beat the damn... Who they play last week? The, the Commanders? The Commodores? I thought we had hope. You can't lose to them. And guess what happened? You lost to them. Wait, wait. I got to get education on these picks. Let me throw the glasses on, man. When I throw the glasses on, I don't miss. This is educational purposes only. All right. <laughs> so we picking the Browns. You know what? In all honesty, change our damn name. If y'all would be called the Cleveland Dogs, like what is a Brown? I know Paul Brown, right? Whoever the Brown, or we don't care. Change the name. Maybe I can get out that sorry ass funk y'all been in for a hundred years. But we going with the Browns. No, the Dogs. D A W G S. They definitely went in, bro. Let me tell you something about this Green Bay and Tennessee game. Malik Willis, you dare to give fucking what is his name? Will Levi Levis? We don't care. Only reason why you was popular in, in college because your girlfriend was fired. And you decided to kick my boy out, but the boy got an arm. Pat, he, not, not Patrick Mahomes. Don't get it confused. Hey, no. <laughs> well, I'm thinking about Patrick Willis. That's the linebacker. <laughs> Malik Willis got a damn arm. The boy could throw the ball 80 yards, man. We got Green Bay beating the Titans. Write it down, man. We go green. Uh, Bears versus Colts. We definitely got the Bears. They got a lot of talent. I feel like they got more talent than the Colts. Colts fans, don't get mad at me, man. Y'all cool. Yeah, we know y'all got the Chiefs number right now. But... Is that right? That's in the past, man. This is the future. The Bears is beating y'all. All the people in this, in, in all comment sections everywhere, telling me that the Vikings actually have a good team. They might have good players, a couple of players, but I know y'all don't think y'all beating the Texans. There's no way. Stop the nonsense, please. I watch too much football. Cut it out. Stop it. So we go in H Town, Houston. That's EJ. That, that's easy. They got CJ. 
Got that boy Tank, Nico Baller. Nico deserved that money. Shit, you should give him more money. They're going to beat y'all, man. This one is crazy right now. Uh, last year, the Eagles got exposed. And I try to tell y'all all last year, if y'all was watching my videos, they can't close out a damn game. These New Orleans Saints are running on some different type of energy. I don't know what the hell is going on in the locker room, bro. You would have thought the bounty gate was out. I'm thinking, it did, he, I was like, is he back? Got to hit the knee, hit it. They got the bounty. So they got to be throwing like a couple of thousand dollars on whoever hurts who or win the game because this shit is crazy, bro. So we got the N.O. We got no Hollins, boy. That's too easy. That's all day. Eagles, I exposed. I can't end it. Y'all tush push for like four quarters, and then when it comes down to the last two minutes, I got nothing, man. Um, we can't talk nothing about the Steelers. I don't want to talk about them. TJ, TJ Watt is a stud, though. Oh, my God. He's a stud. And surprisingly, they culture his defense. It's not surprisingly. It's, it's known. Let me, let me stop. Let me put some more respect in your name. Your culture is defense, and that's what keep y'all relevant. But your offense been stink for years, man. Shout out to George Pickett. But y'all just don't got enough. I feel like I think the Chargers will beat y'all. So we got the Chargers. All right. How many more we got? <laughs> Who cares about this game? Broncos? They're not winning a game this season. Put money down on it right now. We got the Bucks, man. That's too easy. All right. We got a wait, wait, what's, what's my time out? We got a brief intermission right now, man. And this part of this segment, we got to, you know, we got to choose the cheerleaders of the week, man. And Detroit, I've been rocking with y'all for so long, but I seen something that kind of caught the eye a little bit just for one week. Y'all ready? I don't know what the hell I was thinking. I should have had known that Miami got the fire joints. <laughs> what? What was I thinking? I should have put it together because you know Miami. The islands is right there. Cuba. You know, everybody get in the boat. Come there, you know. Like, what was it? What? So I was watching the game. I'm sorry, too. You got the concussion. I know we should focus on you. Rest the brain up. But I was watching you. You know, then I looked up at the sideline. I was like, what? Um, so they get the cheerleader of the week, man. That's my pick. They're going to have a good performance. They're going to be out here. Oh, damn. She's like 6'7". Lord. She tall. <laughs> Yo, know, I, I gotta, I gotta stop. I need some rehab, man. So I, I want to apologize to the city of Miami for for me not knowing what's going on. But I'm, I'm fully tapped in. I'm fully aware. Y'all legit. Y'all legit, man. Shout out to Miami, baby. Shout out to Miami. All right. On a more serious note, let's get back to the picks. The Raiders. I know we're uh, division foes. I feel like we never had beef in the past. I feel like with us is more competitive. We taught y'all for years, you know, the Jamal Charles era, you know. I remember 2001. I remember the day I'm in a in my grandmother room. I'm watching this game. I was like, "There's no way the Raiders lose to the to the Patriots." I was like, "Who the hell's Tom Brady?" Snowing. Tom Brady drops out, come out the pocket. This motherfucker pump faked. 
bro, clearly it was a sack strip. The game is over, man. We come on. It, it just, it's just it's over. The referee, they review this shit. And these motherfuckers really made up a play called the tuck rule. What? What? <laughs> NFL be on some bullshit. I was like, the tuck rule? And the rest was history. I'm happy. Yeah, winning games now. You know I got you. Y'all definitely winning over the sorry ass Panthers. That's easy. Too easy. Seahawks, Miami, Miami, y'all done. Without Tua. And I'm not saying he's the greatest uh, quarterback because I don't think he's okay. He's decent. But y'all don't even have anybody. Scott, Scott like Tom, Thomas? Thompson? Whatever his name is? It's trash. Seahawks all day. Seahawks is winning. This game might go crazy. In my heart, I just don't see Baltimore losing three in a row. That would be insane. Cowboys could do it because they got the offense. They get hot. They get hot. But I just think there's no way to go down 0-3. So my choice right here is the Ravens. Got to be the Ravens. Ravens got to win. This game is the battle. It's just the injuries. San Francisco versus the Rams. I feel like everybody's hurt. But I feel like San Francisco just got that winning culture. They lost to the Vikings. They're not going to lose to the Rams. So I got San Francisco. Easy win. That's right. What's good? Um, Cardinals are hot. They should have won the week. They should be 2-0. Oh. But they choked the game. Detroit plays tough. They bounce back. I feel like they're going to figure everything out. I know Dan Campbell, they in the practice. They're getting the timing together. They will not lose back-to-back -back games. There's no way. So we got the Lions over the Cardinals. That's easy. We're not going to talk about it. I don't want to rub it into nobody's face. We know the Chiefs is winning. Like, I don't want to say it talk about my team 100. With a chance. If you notice my channel, I don't talk a lot about my team just because we're at the top of the mind. There's no need. We're a good team. Yeah, everybody know. That's it. We're not losing to the Falcons. We're not the Eagles. Sorry. Eagles is pathetic. The Bills versus the Jags. For some weird damn reason, bro, the, you got to choose the Bills here, man. The Bills is a good team, apparently. Apparently to y'all. So you're going to you gonna, you gonna stick with the Bills, man. See y'all in the playoffs. It's going to be the same shit. We're going to wax that ass, but is it right? And the Bengals is too experienced. He's not going to lose to Washington, man. So we got the Cats winning that uh, right there. Let me know your picks in the comment section. We're going to run it up. Let's see if we get a little small bet going on. You know, that Detroit Lions hat is still in play, man. So let's figure it out. Uh, let me know how y'all feel. Week three. You know I'm tapped in Sunday. I'll be live for a little bit, chilling, enjoying the game. But then we're going to get on these reactions because week two was crazy. I can imagine what week, week three brings, bro. All right, run it. I love y'all boys, man. Let me take off the glasses, man. I'm looking like a GYN right now, man, with these glasses. Yo, ladies. So say, for instance, if I was a GYN, you schedule a visit. Would you feel comfortable? Let me give you the look. Let me know. <laughs> All right, I'm going. Oh, no. Got too many people watching me. Bye.